And now option to the left side. Lee will keep it, and he tucks it inside. That's the first carry for the quarterback. He had a monster game last week against Virginia. He leads away. The ball nearly got loose. Our first look at Aaron Donald, who is a monster up front from Pitt. Yeah, he's going to line up right here and watch him get behind the line of scrimmage. He makes a living at the line of scrimmage, but he does his best work behind the line of scrimmage in terms of sacks or tackles for loss. He made 25 tackles against people like Tennessee. That's a big tackle up top from Aaron Donald, his second behind the line. That's what you talked about, having a three technique to make plays. That particular three technique is a force, and we've already talked about Donald, and he wasn't blocked well, obviously, but he's man enough to get the fullback and get him on the ground for a loss, and now instead of having third or fourth and one, we got fourth and six. They are five of 11 on the season, and they're going to throw again. Lee has to scramble. Donald got him again. Another tackle behind the line of scrimmage. Aaron Donald will add to his sack totals. Now third and four. Georgia Tech two of three on third down tonight. Lee started going backwards. Paul Johnson doesn't want that. Aaron Donald, another impact play here in the first half. This is the guy for the Panthers that's doing all the damage at the along the line of scrimmage. He's going to be able to read and react. Watch him fight the double team and then skate along the line of scrimmage and stay on his feet. That's the key for the Panthers up front. And they do it by going to Sims, who's quickly bear hugged by Aaron Donald. First man again is Sims. He's got the first down. Donald and Galambos with the stop. That was the first time in Georgia Tech's modern football history. They had three rushers gain 100 and more. Fumble. Quick hit, and the ball ends up with Pitt, and it ends up with Daryl Render. And it looked like Aaron Donald might have been the first guy that caused the fumble. He's right here. Watch him go at the point of attack. He's going to be able to shed that block and get that left hand on the football. But his first goal, he said, is simply to score. Misdirection again, and Lee goes down in the face of Donald. Lee keeps it, and he lost the football. God, I had to dive on it. Lee was stripped from behind by Aaron Donald as he made his turn. Two huge plays for the Pitt defense. And Georgia Tech going backwards. That, that's the stand that the Panthers needed to make on that set of downs. Aaron Donald right here, he's going to get the face, get in front of the face of the lineman, Braun, and just be able to get his left hand on the football. And for Georgia Tech, Godhigh gets on it, luckily, because that's two plays in a row that they've lost big yards.